Will Yuji be the only one left at the end of Jujutsu Kaisen? With each weekly Shonen Jump cover that Gege draws, Yuji has become more and more isolated. And in the JJK leaks, the chapter preview reads as Itadori and Jujutsu Tech slowly corner Sukuna, but special grade battle is getting expanded. Defeat the invincible monster. Do you guys think Sukuna is going to use the black box or malevolent shrine? To defeat everyone else. Yuji might be the only one left. So this chapter is saying Sukuna is going to go all out. And we have leaks coming out on Yuta's birthday. At this point we need Gojo to come back. If not Gojo. Then maybe Toto and Nobara. Are going to come back. Because we still don't know what happened to Toto after Shibuya. He could have easily had his hand fixed by Shoko. And then Nobara. With Nobara, the Sukuna finger theory is out of the question, but Yuji does have a soul technique. What if, with his technique, he was able to awaken Nobara's soul? It's not very likely, but we need to find a way to beat Sukuna, because right now it looks like he's winning. It's Sukuna Kaisen. I think he's going to end up using Malevolent Shrine one more time. And if Gojo does come back, it would be a cool way for him to come back to cancel out Malevolent Shrine with Infinite Void. Or Sukuna's just gonna take everyone out and Yuji will be the only one left at the end of Jujutsu Kaisen.